Hi everyone. In this lecture, we will see the available data types in SQLite. So we have a different data types like null, integer, real, text, blob. Null is nothing but it doesn't have any value and the value itself null. And the data type integer is used to store the values like 1, 2, 3, etc. Any integer value. And the data type real is used to store floating point values. And the data type text is used to store any string or words. And that we have special type of data that is a blob, which means the data is stored exactly the way we provided. SQLite supports the concept of type affinity on columns. Any column can still store any type of data, but the preferred storage class for a column is called affinity. Each table column in a SQLite database is assigned one of the following type affinities. Text, numeric, integer, real, none. Which means, if the affinity is text, this column stores all data using storage class null. Text or blob. Numeric. This column may contain values using all five storage classes. Integer. And along with the previously mentioned data types, we also have Boolean data type. And SQLite doesn't have a separate Boolean storage class. Instead of that, Boolean values are stored as integers 0 and 1. Date and time data type. SQLite doesn't provide a separate storage class for storing dates and times. But SQLite is a capable of storing dates and times in the form of text, real or integer values. For example, we can store the date and time in text by using the format something like yyy that is the year followed by month followed by date. 